Hell now. Uh, hello everyone. <laughs> Welcome back to Dinger Alpha V3. Oh my gosh, we're in the middle of the trial. I went all the way to the intermission for you guys. I hope that you enjoyed the long video. It's very likely that you're gonna get another one if everything works out. Uh, just to let you know, I did reinstall everything because a lot of people are telling me that my game was visually bugged. I did the best I could. I don't know if it worked because, um, well, I just don't know. I couldn't really tell the difference. <laughs> We're gonna see here in a minute. I don't know. Hopefully it did. Uh, I looked for all those visual cues and I can't remember if they showed up or not. I just like skipped through everything because I didn't really want to go through all this again and like think about the story because I didn't want to think too much because it's supposed to be blind. So here we are. Um, well, <laughs> the trial is racing towards its thrilling conclusion. Do you know who the culprit is? I have no idea. <laughs> Not. But I like your little Animal Crossing background you got there. Well, I like that a lot. All right, pray that I fixed it. Really, all I did was to tell Steam to like, you know, re, like assess the files, and then I played through like the last chapter. I don't know. It should be fine. I hope. If not, we're just gonna deal with it. Obviously, I know, uh, cause I know everything. Uh, what? No, everything. Yeah. No, everything. <laughs> Daddy knows everything about anything. He basically traded his bearhood for godhood. Oh. Yes, he has betrayed his Ursine ancestors. Oh, Mana, damn, you actually said something. Huh? Uh, traded? No, I'm still obviously a bear. Uh, it's obvious, right? Uh, right, you guys? <gasps> you sure ain't no fish, but you damn sure smell like one. Now then. Uh, anyway, since I know everything, I'll give you the whole story later. Try your hardest to nab the culprit, and believe me, that's no lie. Uh, if I lied, it would shake the game to its very foundation. <laughs> so trust me, and please enjoy the class trial without any worries. I'll try. Hopefully, I mean, everyone was mad because podiums didn't move, so I'm gonna hope that they move now. I couldn't tell. I saw the, the videos that people showed me, and I'm like, yeah, I guess so. Whoa. Did you just fart? I feel like we're getting kind of rude. Glory part. It's making me nervous. Oh, I hate to tell you this, but I'm assuming there is gonna be a gory part here somewhere. I don't know who the culprit is, but I'm not paying attention, so it's okay. Oh, <laughs> the same? No, I am. Well, I'm trying to. Yes. But there's one thing we do know. You have no butt. The line between what? victim and attacker ain't as clear as you might think. Wait. Really? Oh, uh, is this a red herring or are you trying to make me think? One lesson we can take away from this case. I don't like foreshadowing, especially when I don't know if it's foreshadowing or not. I cut off the leg before the poison spread. Oh. By spring, flowers will grow from the stump. Okay. Can you do that same? Now that is me all over. That's the biggest mood. Okay, fine. Are we back? Did it work? I think so. Either way, this is what we have. Now, I'm worried about this. We obviously figured out at the end of the last one that something's going on with Shuichi. He's not telling us the whole truth. He knows something, and I am freaking nervous about say it. something already. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Maki, make him say something. Your tongue-tied silence speaks volumes. Mm. I fucking knew you were the culprit. Here's what I'm thinking. He either is the culprit or he knows who it is and he's protecting them, which is even worse. But I hope I'm wrong. Wait just a minute. None of that is possible. Oh, Kaida, you're so good. You're gonna... She's gonna, like, defend Shinichi him to the end. So am I. the whole time we were on lookout. That's true. That's true. When are you suggesting Shuichi killed Rantaro? I don't know when he could have done it. Yeah, there were pictures of him, but they were obviously set-up pictures. Like, there wasn't anything weird behind them. Were you really together the whole time? No, he went to go do the thing once, but no, please tell me he's not it. Huh? What do you mean? Oh, dear. I'm asking if you two were on lookout together the whole time. Maki, that is a valid question. Well, I guess we weren't together the whole time. Oh, boy. Okay. I'm gonna check out the basement. I'll come with you. No, you stay and keep watch. Yeah, this is the part. Mm mm. Mm mm. So that's when Shuichi went to kill Rantaro. Oh, shut up. We don't know that for sure. 
No! Shuichi wouldn't kill anyone! I'm inclined to agree, and I really hope uh, it's right. Don't become emotional. We must seek the truth in a calm and logical manner. Oh, it's gonna be hard for her not to be emotional if everyone's gonna blame Shuichi for it, though, huh? Or all our lives will be lost here. He's not wrong, but it's gonna be very difficult for her. I'm not being emotional here. I'm saying it with conviction. Okay, okay, I believe. We believe. Oh, I'm, I'm nervous. Even if Shuichi did go to the basement, he couldn't have killed Rantaro because... Because? Uh, the time it took Shuichi to return. Oh, 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 the security sensor going off. Yes. I get it. I think that. Yeah, 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 yeah. The security alarm didn't ring until after Shuichi returned to the classroom. That's right. He was here when that happened. He was with us. So that's good. It only rang after Rantaro moved the hidden door. Right. Which means he was still alive. Right. Okay. Okay. God. Thank goodness for that. Thank goodness for that. Okay. Surely that if clears Shuichi him. was with me when the alarm went off, then that means he's not the culprit. Right, right. Okay. By the way, I want to confirm one thing with you, Kaede. What? That you're a brat? Yeah, yeah, we already been new. Is your, does your diaper need changing, little one? Who set the security Whoa. sensor on the bookcase? It was Shuichi, right? Yo! Get that weird mask face away from me. I don't like it. I don't like it one bit. Not not even a little. Uh-uh. Ass. <laughs> I'm just looking at class trial going behind him and all I can see is ass. Which is not good, it's distracting. He did set it up, yeah. Huh? What are you saying? That he like rigged it somehow. He wouldn't have done that, would he? Then I'll set up the camera that's connected to the security sensor. I'll set it carefully so the camera has a clear shot when the mastermind moves the bookcase. Let me take care of the security sensor on top of the bookcase. Well, I thought he just wanted to do that because, you know, it was his project, really. It was his plan. And we'll set the cameras near each door. Okay. Y yeah. Shuichi was the one who set up the security sensor. He was. What about it? What about it, indeed? Did you actually check for yourself if the sensor was set on the bookcase, Kayede? Well, wasn't it? Didn't we have pictures of it? No, I didn't check. Uh-oh. Did it ever occur to you that Shuichi could have lied about setting the sensor? Hmm? Mm-mm. You're gonna hear oh, me make why? that noise a lot, I think, in the sun. I'm sorry. <laughs> oh, dear. Shuichi, you haven't said a thing. Well, that's not great, is it? It's not great. Shuichi pretended to place the sensor on the hidden bookcase door. Pretended? But in actuality, he was holding it the whole time. What do you mean, though? Wait a minute. No. And when he that met up with be. you, he secretly triggered the sensor. Wait a minute. To make the security alarm go off. I don't like your Phantom of the Opera face. You could really just never that show that to me again. That would be fine. to assume that someone had moved the bookcase. But, wait a minute though, am I wrong about this? This is already disproven. Sneaky little fucker. Um, wait, hang on here. Something's wrong. No, at this rate, everyone's gonna think Shuichi's the culprit. Yeah, yeah, that's where we're going. I have to do something. I know for a fact he's not the culprit. So, I gotta do something. What are we gonna do? Oh, Tutorial Chan is here. From this point on, lines of white noise will appear to disrupt your reactions. Uh, does white noise happen on easy difficulty? We'll find out, I suppose. Maybe they have to tell you regardless. Your truth bullets will disappear if they touch these lines, so think of them as obstacles. Please time your truth bullets just right so they won't get interrupted by the white noise. Great, because I'm so good at that. You can use the silencer with left click to shoot down the white noise. Now, why would you do that? Because not only does that make it easier to shoot the right weak spots, you will also get additional time. What a great deal. Use it to your heart's content. Thank you for the opportunity. Thank you, Tutorial John. All right, well, let's see if it actually happens. Yeah, I still don't see anyone moving back and forth, but maybe it's fine, I don't know. Uh, receiver on Shuichi, rear entrance, oh god, I don't even know. But 
Uh huh. The moving bookcase isn't what triggered. Oh no, it's still here. As it Bye. turns out, Chuichi had it the whole time. I'll just keep doing the this. The sound Kaede heard came from. Came from. The sensor when Shuichi secretly moved it. Secretly in moved. In order to trigger the alarm. In order to trigger the alarm. So when Kaede heard the sensor go off. Right. She figured someone had. Oh, okay. This is new. Case. Only an idiot can make that mistake. Uh, bye. Boop. Oh shoot, I missed. Uh, boop. Say something. Okay, honestly, okay, this this is on easy difficulty. That was a little bit much. First of all, I guess Shuichi being in the middle, does that mean it's fixed? I couldn't really tell the difference. And second of all, um, God, with all that extra shooting, it's hard to concentrate on what they're saying, but I guess that's what it's for. What did we have? Shuichi couldn't have had the sensor on him. That's right, and I should have evidence that proves it beyond a shadow of a doubt. Think. Think. Evidence that proves it beyond a shadow of a doubt. What do we have? Can we look at that real quick? We have the receiver. What was the other thing? I think there was also, um, he would notify him. The other thing that I saw that was there was, oh, oh was the hidden door photos too? Two photos taken by the camera. First photos, Rantara moving bookcase. Second is a shot of Rantara attempting to move the camera, which is this one. So, between these two... That... That might do it right there. Let's try it, but... Um, okay, if, if I'm right about this, armed, we want hidden door photos. The moving bookcase isn't what triggered it. Oh, shoot, As you know what? Out, I think that's what I wanted right time. there. Mmm, okay. The sound Kaede heard came from... Oh, okay, okay. The sensor when Shuichi secretly moved. I'm gonna have to get used to this. In order crazy. to trigger the alarm. In order to trigger the alarm. So when Kaede heard the sensor go off. Right, right. She figured someone had tried to move the bookcase. Right. Only an idiot can make that mistake. Boop. Oh shoot. Say something. I'm just trying to get extra time here. Okay. I think that's what I wanted. The one right in the beginning that you've got to shoot. Now here's the thing. Is there even more white noise when you don't have it on easy? Jesus Christ. Okay, I think the security sensor was on. I'm gonna have to like concentrate the for this one. There we are. No, that's wrong. You're right. It's it is wrong. Okay, so we did have this. Wait a minute. This is weird. If the security sensor wasn't placed, then if it wasn't placed. We wouldn't have been able to take right. that picture. Those pictures basically prove that it's there. We were only able to get it because the sensor was triggered by the hidden door. Yup. Oh, that's easy to explain. What you mean? Well, you see... God, I'm all frazzled because this is difficult. What you... Yeah? You... Were you going to finish the sentence? No? Uh... Oh. I guess you're right. <sighs> Sorry, I didn't think that far ahead. Time wasted again. Kokichi, please. Oh my god. Same. Yeah, I mean, whatevs. I made a mistake, big deal. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You speak as if you knew that from the start. Even I was taken in. Oh, why don't, why are we even listening to him at this point? So you see, Shuichi can't be the culprit. So he did what he said, because we have the pictures to prove. Now wait just a minute. What's wrong, Ryomo? And what now? The security sensor had a power supply, so what if it went like this? Oh, here we go. What it, What do we got? The security sensor was set up on the bookshelf, and Shuichi had its receiver. Okay. However, Shuichi turned the receiver off. No, he wouldn't do that. Huh? How come? Why would he do that? That would get you a picture, but no alarm when Rantaro moved the bookcase. But, wait a minute. Then... When Shuichi says he's gonna check the basement, he actually goes to the library. Oh, come on, no. And -uh. thanks to the 30 second interval, he's got time to go in after Rantaro. Wait a minute, though. He could have collected the sensor from the hidden bookcase after killing Rantaro. What? Really? Really? I see. Then he caused the receiver to go off in front of Kaede to trick her. I don't know. It seems... It doesn't seem right. Something's wrong. Something's real... I don't like how quiet you're being. You're not helping me at all. It's certainly plausible, considering that Shuichi knew about the intervals. Okay. 
How needlessly complicated. I think it's way too complicated. It's not impossible. No, I don't. Mm, I don't know. Shuichi really is the culprit. <laughs> the problem is, is that I'm letting like past Danganronpa experiences dictate how I feel and what I should know about this, instead of just trusting this process. That's the problem. I want to have like five million what ifs <laughs> in my mind. So the ultimate detective is the killer. What a plot twist! I don't. Uh, I don't know. We're already at that. We're already through the halfway mark, though. That's the problem. Wait. Why do you guys think he's the culprit? This is the part, this is the time, technically, when we usually start to get to the bottom of things, and I don't like that we're still here with him. Shuichi, please say something. Why aren't you saying anything? Did he actually do it then? Uh-uh, I don't like, I'm sick. I don't like- Shuichi, what's wrong? You're not culprit, are you? Uh-oh. Hey. You gonna say anything? That is something they would pull. See, here I go again, though, making the assumption because I've played the other the other games. Like, I would make the assumption that, like, oh, they started you with Shuichi, so you'd love him and then take him away from you. Are you okay with being the culprit? Are you ready to turn yourself in? That would mess up Kaede for the entire rest of the game, wouldn't it? Just like Makoto was messed up with Sayaka. What should I do? Everyone suspects Shuichi. Mm-mm. There's no way he's the culprit, but even so. Shuichi, you all right? He's not. Why won't Shuichi say anything? Is there a reason he won't say anything? Yeah. He either is the culprit or he knows something and I'm worried about both. In neither one of these is a good outcome, we are screwed. That's my gut instinct. If that's the case, then it's all up to me. Wait, what? To protect everyone, I need to take control of this debate. How? Even if, even if that means I have to lie to do it. Wait a minute. Wait, wait, wait. No, 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 no. This is not going to be a thing like in DR1, is it? Where you had to lie knowingly to say... No, already? Come on, do not. Oh, what, what are we going to say? Did you hear that? A lie! Tutorial Chan, frickin' help me. Now I know that sounds crazy, telling a lie in a class trial, but sometimes telling a lie is necessary to reach the truth. Oh, but don't worry, there are no lies in this tutorial. From here on out, there will be times in a debate where you have to lie. Okay, the weak spot, the lie bullet, truth cylinder, the, everything else is the same. There's still some white noise there. Before you had to refute the lies, but now you'll have to lie yourself. Doesn't that get your heart pumping? I guess, but I'm too old for this. Here's how it works. Select a truth bullet like normal non-stop debate. But when you hold right click, the truth bullet will become a lie bullet with the opposite meaning. What? Releasing the right mouse button will shoot the lie bullet. When you use a lie bullet to argue or agree with someone's statement, it will become a perjury, a statement that paints over the truth with lies. While lying, your influence gauge will drain. A successful lie will restore it. Oh, great, so you can't even hold it forever and wait. But if you miss with your lie bullet, you will take damage, so please be careful. Also, I've heard a rumor that there's a secret way to advance debates. It's called a back route. Let's just say that only those who lie well will be able to find it. What? Oh, I thought she meant like the escape button. I was like, girl, I already knew about that. Okay, I guess that's something else. Okay, this, there's a lot of shit to learn in this one. I can't believe that they still somehow keep piling things on here. But here we are. Oh crap, you guys, we are in so much trouble. Now I see the podium's moved now, so I guess we fixed it. Monokuma file moving bookcase receiver. Let's go over the case one more time. Well, it can't be the file. The security sensor was placed on the moving bookcase. Right? I'm just gonna see Shuichi what they say. He also had the receiver. He also had the receiver. But he had it turned off. Of course it was. And so when Rantaro moved the bookcase. Right? I'm trying to a concentrate. A picture was but... taken without the alarm sounding. <gasps> Wait a minute. Then taking advantage of the camera's interval timer. Oh, whoa, whoa. What's going on here? Shuichi hid in the library and murdered the shit out of Rantaro. <laughs> shit. <laughs> And then, he grabbed the security sensor from the bookcase. Okay. And returned to the lookout spot. No doubt about it. <laughs> Afterward, he set off the receiver in front of Kaede on purpose. This is, this is nuts. To make her think the murder had just happened. Praise 
to a tour. We've yep. solved this case. Oh my god. Okay, uh, guys. This is this is insane. Am I crazy? The basis for the suspicion is that Chuichi had the receiver for the security sensor. He had the receiver. If I can argue against that, everything should be okay. Okay, so she wants people to think that she had it instead? Is that what she's saying? I have to retake control. I have to tell a lie so we can get closer to the truth. Let's go over the case one more time. <gasps> receiver on Kaede. Okay. Shuichi also had No. I don't want to do this. Oh. I'll turn this lie into the truth. Perjury. Break. What the hell is happening? Sorry, you guys. I forgot to tell you something important. Oh, very convincing. Did I do it correctly? I don't even know what I did just then. I literally hit the only one that looked real. Forgot? Oh, no. They're not gonna buy this, are they? To tell you the truth, it was me. I had the receiver. Uh-oh. Huh? Uh oh. So that's why there's no way Shuichi could have turned off the receiver. This is not gonna work, is it? What's he gonna do? What's he gonna do? If that is true, then the entire premise of the argument thus far is wrong. The entire thing? Isn't everyone gonna be mad? I wasted everyone's time. Oh look, like you guys do to me is all this the time. True, Kaede? Um, yes? Uh, of course! Oh, Come on, would I lie to you guys? Girl, if you're gonna do this, you gotta be a little more convincing than that. That only screw yourself over. If we mess up, you're dead too, you know. That is... that is true, though. Or perhaps you wanted to cover for Shuichi, even at the cost of your life. That could also be true at this point. Huh? Oh, no. I cannot imagine why anyone would risk their life to lie on another's behalf. Well, it happens that way, sir. It just does. Words from a true heartless robot. Ugh. Emotions are only for meat bags. Don't act like you have any emotions there, Checker. Sit down. That is a harmful stereotype. I can produce heartfelt remarks through calculations. Yeah, yeah. Data did that once in Star Trek The Next Generation. It did not work out for him. Like, less than three? <laughs> Those kinds of calculations? Aw, I love less than three. It's not so unthinkable. All hearts are blind when faced with radiant love. Wow, Keo, can you stop calling me out? Doing anything you write, for the one you love. Hasn't everyone felt that way before? Oh, well, you know, maybe. <laughs> I most certainly have. You least. have? Who is she? I will kill her or him. I'm not, I'm not basing anything. I'm just uh, whoever they are, I'm going to kill them. I'm sure that person didn't want your love. Oh, rude. Some people like creepy folks. <clears throat> Kaede mm -hmm. and Shuichi are pretty buddy-buddy with each other, so I wouldn't doubt that. Yeah, but we're, we're just friends. Kaede. Plus, the way Kaede just acted right now, I'm pretty sure she lied. Okay, well, one thing I'll give him is he probably knows when someone's lying, since he does it so much himself. I'll, A talented I'll give liar him that. like me can spot other people's lies easily. I'll give him that. That's probably the truth right there. Probably one of the true things he'll, like, one of the only true things he'll say. Well, what do you guys think? To believe or not to believe, Kaede? I don't, uh, I don't think this worked out in our favor, did it? Jesus. Um, I do want to believe Kaede, but Shuichi does seem pretty suspicious. I don't, I don't think this worked out in our favor, so what do we even do that for? He has been strangely quiet for a while now. Which is classic degenerate male behavior. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Put Tumblr away for a minute, okay? We're busy. Yeah, I agree. I mean, he has been quiet. That's just suspicious. Doesn't have anything to do with him being a boy. Shuichi is the only person here who's suspicious. Really? So we all agree that Puichi did it? Great. Then let's just vote already! So all that again was for nothing! Woo! No, I still think it is too soon to determine the culprit. Kibo, help us out. Um, I agree. I sort of can't believe that Shuichi is the culprit. Alright, well at least Sumugi believes. Yeah, this ain't right! Me too! Me too, Kaito! I agree! Yay! But I don't know if Atua agrees. Cause right now, it's his nap time! Oh, I mean everyone needs a nap sometimes. This is quite troublesome. It seems our opinions are on opposite ends. Yeah, it seems kinda half and half right now, doesn't it? Shoot. How are we supposed to decide? We're split, right down middle. Ugh. <sighs> uh oh, well, hello? Hi. Split. 
Did you just say split? Just like the butt crack that you don't got. Yes. You did. I heard it. I heard it with my belly button microphone. Stop it. You're making me sneeze. You know, this is the second time that he's come on the screen and made me sneeze. It happened in the last one, too. So wait. Maybe your I'm allergic ears don't to do anything? <laughs> I'm allergic to Monokuma. The Ultimate Academy is proud to present its very own Morph Phenomenal Trial Grounds. I, what? I beg your pardon? What's that? More phenomenal trial grounds? Tutorial Chan, are you coming back? The trial grounds are gonna morph? Oh. Seriously? I totally wanna see that! Wait, wait, like Power Rangers. Alright, get the swords. Either way, we have to do something. Kaede, I think we're in trouble. I really do. We can't vote for Shuichi because he's definitely not the culprit. If we vote for him, all hope is lost. But how is she... She's too sure, though. Are we sure this is right? I won't be able to save everyone. But I haven't lost hope yet. I won't give up. Before I can save everyone, I need to make sure we're all on the same page. Oh, tutorial Chan, help me. You're split down the middle. At times like this, debate scrums are perfect. Great. I'm terrible at debating. In a debate scrum, you'll be split into two teams. What is this now? You know, they're putting a lot of new shit on me at once. Opposing subject, oh, opposing subject keyword, which is nothing. The time and the influence gauge. Then you argue your opinions against each other. But look, everyone's so fired up, so the subjects of your statements don't match. Oh, I see on the other side. Okay. That's not how you debate at all. You have to match your subject with your opponents and put them in the correct order. That's how you make a good debate. Your side subject keywords will be displayed, but your opponent's subjects won't be revealed yet. Listen closely for the subject of your opponent's argument. Before your opponent finishes their statement, use W and S to find the same subject keyword. What? Oh no. Okay. And right click to argue the subject with the same keyword. If you and your opponent's arguments match, then your opponent's keyword will be revealed. And when all statements match, you will enter the finale. Try to convince all your opponents at once. I don't like this. This seems needlessly complicated. Rapidly tap the key displayed on the screen to push your opponent's claim. Oh, great. Quick time events as well, okay? Don't get pushed back. Push their claim out for a perfect refutation. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Tutorial John, can you do this for me? I just want to solve a murder. <laughs> I don't want to do quick time events. I'm not good at such things. All right, here we go. Well, I'm probably gonna fail this, so get ready. I will do my very best. Okay, so wow, Jesus Christ, whoa. Okay, this is kind of neat. Everyone's going for a ride. Not weird at all. Okay, okay. Oh, Jesus. Okay, I'm I'm hopefully ready to do this. Is Shuichi the culprit? Jesus Christ, look at this. Shuichi isn't the culprit. I don't know what to do. Even though you they just did said what you knew about the camera interval, Shuichi. Kibo. Kaede is the what? one who actually had the receiver. The receiver. I'm like Shuichi. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I actually have an airtight alibi. Alibi. Shuichi and Kaede weren't together the whole time, were they? Together. Hirumi! Both of them were together when the receiver uh, went off. Together. If Shuichi had the receiver, it could have been disguised. Disguised? Receiver. Kibo. Kaede is the one who oh, actually I get it. had the receiver. I get it, I get it, okay. I understand, Kaede's I think. Lie, isn't it? Lie. I'll do it. We'll know whether or not it's a lie oh when my we talk God. this through. This is crazy! Okay. You hid what you knew about the camera interval, Shuichi. I missed that one before. Hello? What am I supposed to do here? If our points don't match, then we won't be able to make a convincing argument. I have to match them all. I fucked up that first one because this is insane. <laughs> this is literally insane. So let's try you again. You hid what you knew about the camera interval, Shuichi. Okay, intervals. But Mew silent about intervals too. Here we go. Okay, I'm understanding now. I'm like Shuichi. I actually have an airtight alibi. Alibi. Kaede backed up Shuichi's alibi. 
didn't she? Yeah, yeah, okay. Sorry, guys. She and Kaede went together. The Hirumi! Together? Both of them were together when the receiver went off. I see, I see. Jeez, this if Shuichi had the receiver. Kibo. Receiver. Kaede is the one who actually I'm just gonna cut them the all receiver. off. Because <laughs> I can't. But that's okay. Kaede's lie. Isn't I'll do it. Okay, we'll she's the end. We'll know whether or not it's a lie when we talk this through. Right, right, okay, okay. Guys, I'm sorry, I got it. I thought this said crotch bind. Interesting. D! Give them the D! Oh, it changes. I don't like that. Don't do that to me. Whoa, good Christ almighty. Okay. <laughs> Break! Yay, I did it. I'm sorry, guys. The first one's always terrible. Everyone, you have to believe me. Shuichi is not the culprit. Oh, I want to believe. If we vote for Shuichi, we'll be making the wrong choice. I want to believe. And if that happens, everyone will be executed. My problem is, if it's not him, then I have no inkling on who it is. I definitely won't let that happen. Even if it costs me my life. I don't like this, because... Uh... Well, Kaede, even if you, if it does cost you your life and it's not you, then everyone's in trouble. Kaede. Oh, Shuichi, are you gonna say something? Yeah, it's just like Kaede said. Shuichi ain't the culprit. Look at all our friends that agree with us, too. Gonta believe in Shuichi, too. Yay. Gentlemen always believe in friends. Oh, Shuichi, if you really did it, you probably need to say something now or everyone's in trouble. Well, if Shuichi's not our culprit, then who is? That's the problem, right? Who is? Like, we don't know. Oh boy. We've already exhausted all possible avenues of discussion. That's the other problem, I, I agree. No way. There has to be something else we can discuss. We just gotta think. Like what? Right, Shuichi? Oh, you've gotta say something at this point, sir. You've got to. Huh? Look, I just went through a crazy-ass debate thing for you, please. Shuichi, even though you're not the culprit, you've been quiet for a while. Yep. It's because you realize something, huh? It is. It is. You're scared to reveal the truth. Yep. What is the truth? <sighs> Just tell us. We'll get through it somehow. The truth is better than lying. Because at least then we know where to go. I thought so. What is... Uh-oh. Shuichi. Uh-oh. Answer me this. What kind of truth did you realize? What kind of truth? Don't be scared to say it. Okay. Not just for me, but for everyone else. Yeah, 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 we've got, at this point we have to. Please, face the truth. What is the truth, Shuichi? That's what you need to do. He doesn't want to, because again, the truth, like before when he said, when he became, you know, a famous detective, the truth was also wrong, like it was painful. The truth was terrible. The picture. Which one? Picture? Which picture? The picture from the camera aimed at the hidden door, just before the murder. Okay. The one with Rantaro's face. Yeah, yeah, what about it? I always thought it was suspicious, the way Rantaro was acting. What's suspicious about it? He saw a camera and he was like, oh crap, someone's looking at me? That's what I in interpreted it as. Hmm? What's suspicious? What's weird about it? If you look at the picture, it looks like Rantaro is trying to remove the camera. Well, maybe because he didn't want to get caught by whoever was looking at him. But that must mean he noticed the camera we set up. But it's possible to have noticed it, right? They only put it, like, on books. It wasn't that well hidden, was That's it? That's true. But when did he notice that? So, I mean, if he noticed the moving door and everything, he could have just been going over everything with a fine tooth comb. I believe it was when the camera took its first picture. The first picture when he was moving the bookcase? That one? This picture was taken when Rantaro moved the bookcase. Right, right. What's At wrong with moment, it? At that moment, something made him notice the camera. <gasps> I, I know! I know it! Look, the flash! Look, there's a, there's a giant shadow behind him and... Okay, so I thought maybe it was lit up like this because of just the aesthetic of everything being so dark. Didn't they turn the flash off on purpose to not have it alert anyone? That's why it's so lit up. Like I said, I thought it was just the art style they were going with. Like, everything else is blacked out. You don't need to see anything else in the room. Is that what they're actually going for? If the flash went off here, that would make him go right face first to the camera, and even then his face did look very lit up. But again, 
I overlooked that at first because I thought it was just aesthetic. I didn't even think. So he tried to remove it. Oh my god. That's when the bookcase closed. So look, you can see the shadow here as well. It's very obvious now. The oh. sensor was triggered and that's when this picture was taken. Oh my god. The flash. If that is the case, we must find the reason why he That's got to be it though. But how did it fail? You're confusing everyone. Except me, of course. Oh, of course. Just get to the fucking point. Girl. I've been contemplating what it could be. Why did he notice the Girl, camera? Girl, if those flashes failed, then you in trouble because you're the ones that worked that out, ain't you? Miu. And the answer is in this picture. It is. I mean, technically it's in the other one as well, I think, but... I see. Shuichi knows. The reason why Rentaro noticed the camera was the camera flash. Oh my goodness. It. Well, I'm so, I feel so stupid that I didn't notice that. Because of the flash, right? All right. Well, now I won't take anything for granted, right? When I look at stuff. Yeah. The flash. Yes. The flash went off when the hidden door camera took a picture. Right, right. Rantaro okay. noticed the camera's flash. And that seemed to be the only one. But how can you tell the flash went off? There's a bunch of shadows there, girl. Well, if you compare it to the other pictures I that didn't we have, even notice. I bet you the other pictures don't have any shadows at all. Remember the pictures that were taken when I took down the cameras? I bet you I didn't even notice. Oh, look at that. This is the picture taken when I removed the front camera. So everything is still technically lit. Not a lot, of course, but enough that you couldn't well This is the picture from when I removed the rear camera. See, what they're saying is his face isn't so lit up, probably, not the background shadows. Yeah, that's definitely this different. Boy, I'm stupid. It's the picture of Rantaro. Oh, man. Whoa! The brightness is totally different. It is. Same room, circumstance, and camera. And yet, there's oh, a okay. brightness. Did anyone get that at first when they, like, saw the picture? They're like, hey, wasn't the flash on button? Because I feel stupid now. Because only the camera aimed at the hidden door had the flash turned on. Oh, okay. How did that happen? What was the purpose of leaving the flash on? Well... Especially since it was meant to be hidden. Well, I thought we weren't supposed to do that. <laughs> Technically, I thought we would turn them off. A mistake, maybe? Maybe? It's no mistake. What? There was an objective here. Was there? That camera was placed for another reason. What do you mean? You're the one that placed it. Another reason, huh? What? There's only one reason the camera's flash was used. To take a picture of the mastermind, to light up the room, to lure them at... To lure them closer, maybe? To get a good photo of it. Either way, we would have gotten a picture. We don't need to light up the room. Oh, shoot! Oh crap, I'm sorry. I was thinking. Oh god. I didn't mean can I can I do that over please? Don't worry about that. It's fine. Happens. To learn closer. Gosh darn it. I get it. Darn it. I was just thinking sitting there thinking this ain't Phoenix right. I don't have time. The was used to lure whoever moved the bookcase to the camera. But I thought that wasn't part of our our plan though. I am so confused. So when the flash went off, they would have noticed the camera right away. But who but Shuichi, that was you that did that? And that's exactly what happened. Because I really thought we agreed to have the flashes off so it wouldn't alert anyone. Rantaro moved the bookcase, noticed the flash, and then walked over to the camera. Okay. But the culprit didn't expect the camera to take another picture when the door closed. Right. Okay. Hey, Kaede? Wait a minute. What is it? Wait a minute. Is something wrong? What? <gasps> You've been acting kind of strange. Isn't that the camera that Kaede set up? The one to the right of the bookcase? Or am I crazy? Shuichi definitely set up the one over it. The one with the sensor. Possibly the other one. But that was the one that Kaede set up. When she was arranging the books, too, on that side, right? It's all the same side. So that was her side. F strange? Uh-uh. Don't do this to me. Your last few remarks carry more conviction than before. Oh, shit. Do you know who the culprit is? Stop. No, don't do this. Oh my god! Yep, I know. 
I've known for a long time. Hmm? Long time? No way! Because there was only one person able to set the flash on the camera. What? Are we having a Dahlia Hawthorne moment here? Isn't that right, Shuichi? Shuichi, is that what you know? What the v- The culprit of this incident is... Are. You. Serious? Oh my god! Are you serious? No doubt about it. Shut up! Wait a minute! What the- What- ho ho wa wa- Wait a minute now! I need to think, I need to think. Well, this is as far as it goes. Did it ha- How did this happen? She's not the mastermind. I couldn't do it. I couldn't get to the mastermind. Does, see what I'm saying right here? If she was- Oh, wait a minute now. I'm sorry, everyone. Did this happen because she was trying to catch the mastermind, but she killed him by accident? But wait a minute, how did she kill him? We still don't know how it happened. I'm sorry, Rantaro. You set the flash, I get it, but... Are they saying because of the flash, he got killed? But we still don't know who aimed the ball and stuff. I'm wait sorry. a minute. Shuichi. This is still too early to decide. I don't understand this. You stayed silent this whole time because you realized it already, right? What the hell is happening? But you can't do that. What the f- It may be the end of me, but I want my wish to. I'm giving it to you, Shuichi. Wait, Kaede, you can't leave. You're the protagonist. From now on, you're going to carry on my wish. What? You're going to protect everyone. What the f- The hell? Kaede, I know what you want me to do. Oh, Shuichi! So cool. Oh my! This can't be happening. It's, it's cool, but Shuichi. I understand. I'll do it. Really? You can trust me. I won't let your wish. Oh my! Oh my goodness me, I'm gonna cry. And it- we have no- this is the first fucking trial! What the hell? Wait, this can't be over, we still haven't figured out how. Kaede is the culprit. I get it, I get it. Rantaro was killed because she set the flash. But what about the rest? Huh? Surely we're not finished. Kaede, are you just gonna say everything now? Kaede did it? I need a fucking drink. Hang the hell on. Wait! That's not possible! Holy shit. Right, Kaede? Th I never would have seen this coming in a million years. Yeah, I thought for maximum heartbreak they were gonna pin it on Shuichi because you got close to him, but... Uh, game? You ramped it. The protagonist. On the first trial? K Kaede? How in the world is this gonna play out? I- Fucking speechless. Well, not Wait, really. Wait! Did she really- I don't even know what to say. <laughs> what? Just kidding! Wait, 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 what? No, you cannot turn into Kokichi now. Just kidding? What is happening? Huh? Did you guys really think I'm the culprit? Did- As uh, she- She lost her marbles. What is happening right now? Shh, come on, guys. Like I could. What the- what? When Rantaro was murdered, I was in the classroom with Shuichi, remember? Yes, that's what I'm saying. Couldn't have, I- I thought they were just saying she set the flash, so Rantaro died because of that, but we- yeah, we still can't do it just because of that. We have to figure out the rest. After that, we went to the library, and that's the first time I even saw his body. We do have an alibi for that. Shuichi was there. Plus, I never met up with Rantaro. I never had a chance to kill him. That's right. Yes. No way Kaede could be culprit. Maybe she just put the flashback on because it, you know, temporary insanity. She wanted to get a picture so she knew for sure. 
Even though that put a wrench in the whole plan. Jeez, of course not. <sighs> Do you think I'm even strong enough to throw that shot? That's what I was saying. How did that even My happen? hands are only strong enough to play piano. To be fair, you've got to have some good hand strength to play piano, though. Then accusing you of being the culprit is... What was this for, then? <laughs> yep, it's wrong. Shuichi's what? just joking around. Wait. He wanted to lighten up the mood. No, this doesn't seem right, though. Right, Shuichi? Something's wrong. No matter how you look at it, I couldn't have killed Rantaro with that shot. What? What? Wait a minute! She- Oh my god. She could have, though. She could have. What if she had it with her? She was in the room right above the library. There was a vent. I said that earlier. I think everyone's afraid of learning the truth, but the people who are willing to find the truth are the ones who can decide their fate. If you never know the lies from the truth, then you can't choose a path. You won't even know you're on a path. So, fight for the truth, even if it's frightening. I know you can do it. Oh, Shuichi looks so cute in here. I can't even. I can't even. If you're scared, borrow the strength of others who will be there to help you. Think of everyone you're helping and let that be your strength. I, you've got to be shitting me. They're no, really pairing this on her? I'm joking around. <sighs> Kaede definitely killed Rantaro. What is happening? What the hell did you just say? Kaede! Was it a fucking ruse the whole time? It seems as though Shuichi is serious after all. It seems so. Why would he say that? Of course I am. Uh-oh. Oh, Kaede, I don't like this girl. Mm-mm. You try getting to my good graces, I was excited that there was a female protagonist. Now what you gonna do? Why don't you tell me then? How did I kill Rantaro with that shot? Is she doing this on purpose? Or is, has she lost her marbles? Yeah, how? You and Kaede were together the whole time, weren't you? No, not when Shuichi went down to the basement real quick. How Kaede killed Rantaro with the shot put ball. Right? He, he did leave for that moment. It should become clear when you consider where she used it. Okay, that's what I'm saying, the room, right? Where she used the shot put ball? The room, it's above the library. Oh, Angie, it's okay. I'll explain. You sweating now, eh? Kaede wants me to reveal the truth. She trusts me with her wish. So, I can't back down. I need to fulfill her wish. I need to fight for the truth. I, I can't even believe that this is happening. What do we have? Monica file, bloody shot. It's either the shot put ball or the lookout alibi. classroom. When Rantaro was killed. Yeah, let's see what that is. I was in the classroom, standing watch with Shuichi. That's true. Kaede never saw Rantaro. Okay. Then how she kill him? No it's important to establish where the culprit used the shot. Okay. We know that it was in the library. We know that it was in the library. Rantaro was killed in the library. Killed in the library. That's the only explanation. Really? In which case, it's impossible for me to be the culprit. Well, I can't shoot that, can I? Kaede wants me to reveal the truth. Okay. I think I know. I have an alibi. So it is the lookout classroom. When Rantaro was killed... It's right above it, right? I was in the classroom, standing watch with Shuichi. So that's... This is a true statement. Kaede never saw Rantaro. And how she kill him? It's important to establish where the culprit used the shot. Right. We know that it was in the last... <laughs> There we go. That's wrong! I didn't get the V, but that's okay. Break. Kaede didn't use the shot put ball at the scene of the crime. Oh no, it's like I said. It fell from above. It fell from above. She used it at the first floor classroom where we were keeping watch. Oh my god! Girl! Hold up. How could she have hit Rantaro with a shot from a different floor? Because... She rolled it. Physics! 
she rolled the shot from the first floor classroom and hit Rantaro. Through the vent, of course. I am skeptical that she could perform oh. such a feat of accuracy. <laughs> they they still think it's because like they rolled down the stairs or something, right? Like they don't understand. So it was a magic shot put ball? Yeah, yeah, yeah. They don't get it. That's not possible. I thought we brought up the vent before though. I guess maybe they forgot. It is possible. Yeah, yeah, we're gonna tell them right now. If you do it at the right spot in the classroom, yep. it will reach the library. Yeah, yeah. So it seems you already know about that. Kaede, why? I didn't want to figure it out. I didn't want to know. But I can't turn away from the truth. The place she rolled the shot put ball to move it from the classroom to the library. I know this. Oh, what is this? No. I, mm -mm. I'm done. Done with the game. I don't want this. Now, people did say it was better, but they also said it was different. So I'm scared. All right. The keyword, the letter orb, the flash spot. What the hell? Time. Tutorial John help. When you need to deduce a keyword, you will be thrown into Hangman's Gambit version 3.0. Let me guess. Is this improved as well? The objective is to select the letter orbs in the right order to create the keyword. Left click to activate the flash spot to read the illuminated letter orbs. While the letters are illuminated, you will not actually be able to select a letter orb. So make sure you remember where they are and right click to get it. Oh my- what? You have to get it in the dark. Okay. But remember, you have to select them in the correct order. Deduce the keywords from the letter orbs that you can see in the flash spot. The flash spot uses focus energy. Please use it wisely. This is gonna be tragic. <laughs> Waves of light will also occasionally cross the screen so you can read the letter orbs then. So take advantage of that as well. So right click to select them, left click to light them up, okay. Thank you for listening to me. Girl, I will listen to you all day. You're the only thing that saves me around here. Hangman's Gambit. I'm assuming we want vent. V. Oh, oh, okay, you don't have to do it all at once. Oh, I see. It's only in the middle. E. Where's N? Oh, there's N. Oh, I see. Okay, this is not- this is not that bad. This is not nearly as bad as the second one. Oh, thank goodness for that. Okay, complete. The classroom's bent. Yep, 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 okay. If you were to roll the shot in there, it would reach the library. Yep. See. Wait a minute, I've that got a question. The classroom to the library. Wouldn't they hear it? A, a shot put ball going through a metal vent? Wouldn't it make a huge racket? I know this is just semantics, like it doesn't matter. So, the shot is rolled into the vent, passes through the door. Wouldn't that make a big clamor? <laughs> like, you'd hear that. It seems weird. And comes out of the air vent above the library bookcase. This is why she stacked the books. If she hadn't done, it might have gotten stuck up there or something. I I bet you anything that's what it is. Hit Rantaro from all the way over there. It fell on him, girl. Physics, do you understand? The vent was way too far from Rantaro's body. It rolled down the books. She placed them up that way on purpose and made a ramp. That's why she was so keen on doing so it. So it was just a coincidence? Nope. What no kind of coincidence planned. is that? Yeah, there's no way it was a coincidence. Mm, what a mystery. Oh my gosh, you guys, come on, think. No, I already know the answer to that as well. You do. It was no coincidence. The culprit set it up that way intentionally. If I'm remembering correctly, there was something off about her then. I remember how into it she was to stack the books. Damn it. How could I not realize it? Me too, friend, me too. Girl, you've got a lot of explaining to do right now. It's too late to regret the past. I said I wouldn't back down. I made a promise. Oh, gosh, okay. All right. Stack book. It's gotta be the stack books, obviously. The shot that fell from the vent. Right? How did it strike Rantaro's head from that distance? Well, I don't know. You tell me. Yeah, that's impossible. It's not like it started rolling on its own. Rolling on its own. Nope. I agree. I'm doing it right now. Yeah, I agree with that. She set it up so that it made a ramp. Or, you know, a little path. 
I didn't even listen to the rest of shit on that. Like we almost said. Okay. The shot rolled along the top of the bookcase and fell on Rantaro's head. Right, right. It rolled along the bookcase? Yeah, yeah. I did say that, but would the shot have rolled that conveniently? It would if you did it yourself. It has nothing to do with convenience. The shot rolled exactly how the culprit wanted. Yep. They used books on top of the bookcases to direct the path of the shot. Right. The shot's path was directed by books? How would that even work? Here's the question I've got in my mind, even though we're not there yet. Did she mean to kill Rantaro or just whoever was there because she thought she would kill the mastermind? I guarantee that's what it is, right? She's not uh, evil. It would be easier to explain with a floor plan of the library. Please tell me she's not evil. Okay. Oh, that's right. Someone did have a floor plan. In fact, that might be concrete proof of my theory. <gasps> oh, I know! Miu! Her drone! She mapped it out. That's it. Of course. You. I recall that during the investigation. Okay. You said yeah, yeah. you use your drone to make a floor plan. She did. Okay. Oh yeah. What happened with that? Did you do it? Do you have that? Ha. I've already developed the photos and drafted some sketches. Damn, you were busy. Then let's look Can at. Can see it. them? Maybe we all find clue. Oh god, I love him Please, so much. Mia. Oh, want him that badly, huh? Fine. But now you owe me one. I'll owe you, it's fine. Voila! Feast your eyes on these babies. Whoa, 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 wait. This is a serious moment. Oh, okay. Oh. Wow, look at that. Yeah, yeah, that's really helpful. Look, you can kind of see it even though it's, it's you know, definitely a, you know, top-down perspective. You can see that she stacked the books from high where the vent is to lower down to Rantaro is so that it falls off. There's still some room for error there, but not a lot. It's just as I thought. A very small margin. Oh my god, Wait, Kaede. What is? You smart little bastard. I can't even be mad. I'm see, impressed. The books are stacked like stairs from the vent to where Rantaro's body was found. That that's why it took so long for her to do it. She was like Crazy exhausted after the end oh, of it. Oh, Shuichi is right. Look at that. And see, there's a little stopper point right there, too, so that it doesn't roll off prematurely. Indeed. They are stacked like stairs. I did not notice when I looked up from the floor. Yeah, yeah, you wouldn't be able to see it from down there. I see, I see. The shot rolled on top of these books, eh? Yup. Yes. I'm sure of it. Right. Kaede. You had a plan, though. The shot was rolled into Seriously, the classroom vent. Seriously, that's smart. It came out in the library. God, I bet, please, she was only trying to kill the mastermind, right? She thought that that would end it. Look at if that. If the vent was open, the shot would have maintained momentum. Which she also did. She opened the vent. And you did that, right, Kaede? Yep. You made sure the vent was open. Wow. She was trying to kill the mastermind. I'm going to go with that. She didn't do it on purpose. She did this because she thought it would work. She's still a good girl, which makes this even worse. She, right, she pushed the grade in. And then she thought that this would help people not be able to get through. Boy, it was all planned. Oh, I can't believe. Impressive. You have a really good memory, Shuichi. She did it on purpose. She knew that if she killed someone, well, maybe she didn't know, because maybe she really thought if she killed the mastermind that it would be over. She killed somebody else by accident, and now she knows she's going to die for it. Oh my goodness. What a tragedy. When the shot came through, the stacked books made it change direction. Right. Right, right. Yep, she set it up. Wow. It rolled down the path made by the books. I still feel like you would have heard this a little bit, but maybe I'm crazy. Like, I would have moved. But maybe that's why she also had the, the flash books were to kind of. In rows so that the shot wouldn't fall off. To, to, to distract him with the flash boy it was all really laid At out the wasn't same it time, the books blocked the shot from view right look at it carefully laid out even then, open books the ball was directly above Rantara oh my god can you direction. imagine getting bopped on the head like that rolled along the groove of definitely the open would have killed him that's awful on top of she oh sorry Shuichi, I didn't mean to cut you off and it was the camera flash right. that lured him to that exact spot. Wow. Wow. I am, I'm 
gobsmacked right now. A setup that complicated is almost like a Rube Goldberg machine. That's right. So Kaede created this mechanism? Kaede, you're a lot smarter than everyone gave you credit for. Well, it would be... Wait, even with the Rube whatever oh. setup, <laughs> when did she roll the ball into the dock? When Shuichi was gone to check, of course. That's right! Wasn't Shuichi with Kaede in the classroom? No, when he left! Girls! D guys, do you know you guys are all goldfish. You don't remember what we talked about five minutes ago. When did Kaede roll the Oh wait a minute, you know what? No! Because maybe that's why she would <gasps> Okay! I got it. I think I got it. My whole argument earlier, and I thought I was just being picky, was like, wouldn't people have heard it? What about when the music was playing and they left, just as they left? Could that have been it? It would have had to have been just the right time to kill Rantaro. Okay, they rolled the shot. When she was leaving. That's probably it. That's probably it. Then they're all walking down. There's a lot of things together. Everyone's distracted. Maybe the that's why they didn't the hear classroom. it. Oh my god, I'm sorry for all the gasp. When the sensor god. went off, I ran out first. It's probably first. really annoying. And then Kaede followed. Okay, okay, okay. But just before she left. I'm sorry, I'm sorry if I get too into this for anyone, like, and they're just annoyed. I, I'm just, I'm an old person and I'm really into this shit. <laughs> right. Right, okay. So they're hurrying, they're scrambling, the music's going crazy, right, at the same time. So maybe then it would have been a little bit muffled, because really, the first thing I thought of was, wouldn't someone have heard that and said, hey, I heard some rumbling or something? They probably right. couldn't. Aren't I, the crazy music, of course. Of course, the ultimate detective would remember all that. It was driving everybody bonkers, right? Your so they didn't even have thoughts. And that smile. Is this your admission of guilt? Well, I'm sorry I don't get to harp on you a little bit longer, Handsome, but it looks like our days are numbered. Hold on! Don't just jump to conclusions! I've still got a lot of questions! Like what? <laughs> That's weird! <laughs> Why do you sound so desperate? Because he doesn't want Kaede to be the... the killer. He, I think he fancies her a little bit. There's nothing weird about it! He doesn't want anyone to die. There's just no way I could believe someone like Kaede would be the culprit. Yeah, I think he does fancy her a little bit. Yeah, going to not believe it either. They, they also, you know, they believe in her as well. What? That's important. Oh, Kaede, you really did make the friends that you wanted. Don't worry, Kaede. I'll clear your oh, name. Oh, this is so sweet and heartbreaking. Wait a minute, what are we doing? Okay, what are we debating? Hello? Stacked books, Rantaro's belonging, the shop football, and the promotional video. I refuse video. to believe that Kaede is the culprit. Okay. I still have my doubts. Doubts? What kind of doubts? Doubts about the noise, of course. Noise? Oh, yeah, so he's bringing it up. Quiet, right? The library should have been quiet. Oh! That shot was rolling That's what beds. I needed right there, probably. It would have made a ton of noise. A ton of noise. Indeed. So much noise. The noise could Rantaro also be would have heard. Any of these could be it, actually. Yeah, some noise ain't a big deal. Mm. Of course it's a big deal! The sound of the shot rolling. I know this. So they did bring it up. I refuse to believe that Kaede is the culprit! Okay. I think I'm I right. I still have my doubts. Well, we could just try them all. We'll still live. <laughs> we'll still make it. Doubts about the noise, of course. The library should have been quiet. The library should have been quiet. Ooh. Uh-oh. If nope. that shot was rolling through the it. Sorry. Sorry. It's a little hard to aim. Oh no. Payday is the culprit. Yeah, yeah. What kind of doubt? Well, is the V thing gonna be in the same place? I'll just get ready. I'll just get ready for it. Library should It is the same. Nice. Alright. Yeah, yeah, we know. We've been new. Okay. The murder occurred while the Killing Game promotional video was being broadcast. Right, it was loud as balls. So the library. God, it all makes sense now when you put it all together. Oh. So that ghastly video drowned out the sound of the shots rolling. Yup. What? 
That's right. Kaito, are you done now? I'm sorry, Kaito. Oh, he really is a good guy. Damn it! So it's true then? I think so. You're saying Kaede really is the culprit? But I don't think she meant it. So that means most of Kaede's sins were committed right before Shuichi's eyes. I think she meant to kill the mastermind, not actually kill anyone else. That's correct. It's just bad luck. I was with her in the classroom. Yeah, yeah. And when she moved the vent grate aside. Right, 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 okay. And when she lined up the books on top of the bookcase. You were there, Shuichi. You were there for us. Yeah, yeah. Top of the bookcase is covered end to end with cluttered stacks of books. This is nothing. As I move the ladder, we organize the books bit by bit. Right, it took her like all day. Oh, there are too many books. It might be too hard to set up a camera here. I thought so. Wait, I just gotta try a little harder. Kade, I know you don't like to admit defeat, but really, right, this is why she's so adamant about it. I continued moving the ladder as I kept reorganizing the books. It had to be perfect. And it was the same when you took the murder weapon, wasn't it? Okay. Because we were you there. You took the shot put ball when you got the cameras for yep. me, right, Kaede? We, we were there. With him. He saw us do it. Well, he didn't really see it, but we were in the room. Kaede, is something wrong? We need to go before Mio changes her mind. Shuichi was already at the door of the warehouse waiting for me. Oh, sorry. I shoved the things I was holding into my backpack and ran after him. Maybe he didn't see what she was holding. So she stored we it in the backpack. The entire time? That makes sense. Where would she have even hidden it? In her backpack. That's, that's not it's rocket science. Could only be one place. Guys, come on. You guys. You guys aren't six years that's old. It. You could have worked that out. She's one of the only Kaede's people, if not pack. with a backpack. She was carrying the shot put ball in there. I think she's the, actually the only one with a bag. Despite its weight, it would have been easy to carry in a backpack. Yeah, yeah. I noticed you also had a spare vest. Well. Which you could have wrapped it in. Gonta has a bag, but it's, it's a bug container. It's not the same. That would prevent the cameras you were carrying from being damaged. Yup. You planned everything. Everything, Kaede. And that means all of this happened right in front of Shuichi. Yeah. But we should not blame him for that. No, 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 we won't, we won't. None of those actions warranted suspicion at the time, so we might not have noticed. Right, of course. Shuichi, it's okay. Except it's that not. That clears it all up, then. Every part of the crime Kaede plotted. Yep, yep, he's innocent. That can't be. It's gotta be mistake. Right? I'm sorry. Kaede, I, I, I believe in you. I know why you did it. But if all of that is true, then that's pretty unfortunate. Don't lie, you don't care. I mean, it's Kaede, you know? You really don't care about this, do you? She kept preaching about working together, and then she goes and kills in cold blood. I, no, she didn't want to kill. still doesn't fit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Shuichi, tell them. Tell them. Hmm. What doesn't fit? <laughs> what doesn't fit? Byakuya said the same thing. Kaede wouldn't do something like that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Come on, we gotta believe in her. Huh? Come on. This is the this is the thing that's gonna keep them going. You mean she's not the type? But you were the one that said she did it, right? Right, right. Yes, I did say that. But murder in cold blood is just not in her character. No, she had an agenda for sure. I truly believe that. I believe in her. Oh my god, Shuichi's so good. But why? Because we know that you wanted to keep everyone together. You were just hoping you could end it quickly. 